Passion Travail is a chain specializing in everything related to travel, street food, and like subscribe if you like the content. Accra, deep fried bean fritters, often made from black eyed peas, served with spicy pepper sauce. Accra is a popular Nigerian food made from black eyed peas or beans. It is a deep fried bean cake or fritter that is commonly eaten as a snack or breakfast dish in Nigeria and other West African countries. To prepare Accra, black eyed peas or beans are soaked in water to soften them. The outer skin of the beans is then removed, and the beans are ground or blended to form a smooth paste. The paste is seasoned with ingredients such as onions, peppers, salt, and spices, which can vary depending on personal preference. Traditionally, Accra is deep fried in vegetable oil until golden brown. The fritters are typically round or oval shaped and have a crispy exterior with a soft, fluffy interior. They are usually served with a side of spicy pepper sauce or eaten with bread, pap, a Nigerian cornmeal porridge, or gari, a cassava based grain. Accra is not only delicious but also nutritious. Black eyed peas are a good source of protein, fiber, and various vitamins and minerals. It is a popular street food in Nigeria and can also be found in local markets and food stalls. Aloko, fried plantains, usually served with a spicy tomato and onion sauce. Aloko is a popular street food and snack in Ivory Coast, Côte d'Ivoire, and some other West African countries. It consists of fried plantains that are typically served with a spicy tomato onion sauce. To prepare aloko, ripe plantains are peeled and cut into thick slices or chunks. The plantain pieces are then deep fried until they become golden brown and crispy. The frying process gives aloko a slightly sweet and caramelized flavor. Once fried, the aloko is usually sprinkled with salt or a spice blend for added flavor. It is commonly served in a paper cone or on a plate and accompanied by a dipping sauce made with tomatoes, onions, peppers, and various spices. The sauce can range from mildly spicy to very hot. Depending on personal preference, a loco is often enjoyed as a quick and satisfying snack or street food. It is commonly found in food stalls, roadside vendors, and markets in Ivory Coast and other West African countries. It can be eaten on its own or as a side dish with grilled meat, fish, or other local dishes. Poule bicyclette, grilled chicken marinated in flavorful spices, often served with a side of a teak, cassava couscous. Poule bicyclette is a term used in West Africa, particularly in Francophone countries like Ivory Coast and Senegal, to refer to a specific type of chicken. The term translates to bicycle chicken in English, and it is named as such due to the belief that the chicken's lean and muscular meat is a result of the bird's constant movement and exercise, much like someone riding a bicycle. Poule bicyclette refers to a local breed of chicken that is typically smaller in size compared to commercially raised chickens. These chickens are often free range and allowed to roam and forage for their food, which contributes to their leanness and flavor. They are believed to have a more natural diet and are not usually fed with artificial growth hormones or antibiotics. The meat of poulet bicyclette is valued for its tenderness, flavor, and firm texture. It is often considered more flavorful than larger, commercially raised chickens. In West African cuisine, poulet bicyclette is commonly used in various traditional dishes, such as grilled chicken, stews, and soups. Poulet bicyclette is a popular choice for many locals in West Africa due to its taste, perceived health benefits, and the preference for supporting local, small scale poultry farmers. Chigunmi, grilled or roasted corn on the cob, often sold by street vendors. Chigunmi is a traditional dish from Benin, a country in West Africa. It is a flavorful and hearty stew made with smoked fish and a variety of vegetables. Chigunmi is a popular dish in Benin and is often enjoyed with fufu, a starchy staple food made from cassava, yam, or plantains. The key ingredients in chigunmi include smoked fish, such as smoked catfish or smoked mackerel, tomatoes, onions, peppers, such as habanero or scotch bonnet, and leafy greens, such as spinach or amaranth leaves. Other ingredients may include palm oil, garlic, ginger, and various spices. To prepare chigunmi, the smoked fish is first soaked in water to remove excess salt and then flaked into smaller pieces. Discarding any bones. The vegetables are chopped, and the tomatoes are often pureed or crushed to form a base for the stew. 
in a pot, palm oil is heated, and the onions, garlic, and ginger are sautéed until fragrant. The pureed tomatoes and peppers are added, and the mixture is cooked until the flavors meld together. The smoked fish and any additional spices are then added, followed by the leafy greens. The stew is simmered until the vegetables are tender and the flavors have melded. Chicken meat is known for its rich, smoky, and slightly spicy flavor. It is often enjoyed as a main course and is typically served hot with fufu, which is used to scoop up the stew. It is a popular dish during festive occasions and gatherings in Benin, showcasing the country's culinary traditions and flavors. Zomli, a popular street food in northern Benin, Zomli is a pancake like snack made from rice or cornmeal. Zomli, also known as Zomlik Plakbla, is a popular traditional dish from Togo, a country in West Africa. It is a savory bean and vegetable stew that is often enjoyed as a main course. Zomli is known for its rich flavors and nutritious ingredients. The main ingredients in Zomli include black eyed peas or cow peas, leafy greens, such as spinach or amaranth leaves, tomatoes, onions, and various spices. Other vegetables such as eggplant, okra, or pumpkin can also be included based on personal preference. To prepare zomli, the black-eyed peas or cow peas are soaked overnight or for several hours to soften them. They are then cooked until tender. In a separate pot, onions and tomatoes are sautéed in oil until they soften and release their flavors. The cooked beans are added to the pot along with water or broth and the mixture is simmered to allow the flavors to meld together, leafy greens are often added to the stew, which are washed, chopped, and added towards the end of the cooking process. This helps to retain their vibrant green color and freshness. The stew is typically seasoned with spices such as garlic, ginger, chili peppers, and a variety of local seasonings to enhance the flavors. Zomli is usually served hot and can be enjoyed on its own or accompanied by a side of steamed rice, plantains, or fufu, a starchy staple food. It is a nutritious and filling dish, incorporating a combination of protein, fiber, and vitamins from the beans and vegetables. Zomli is a popular traditional dish in Togo and is often prepared for special occasions, family gatherings, or as a comforting meal on cooler days. Its flavors and ingredients reflect the culinary heritage of the region. Brochettes, skewered and grilled meat, usually beef or chicken, marinated in spices and served with a side of sauce. Brochettes are a popular grilled meat skewered dish enjoyed in many countries around the world. The term brochette is derived from the French word for skewer. These skewers typically consist of small pieces of marinated or seasoned meat, poultry, seafood, or vegetables threaded onto a metal or wooden skewer and grilled or barbecued until cooked to perfection. The specific ingredients used for brochettes can vary depending on regional and cultural preferences. In many places, brochettes commonly feature beef, chicken, pork, lamb, or a combination of these meats. The meat is typically cut into bite-sized cubes or strips, allowing for even cooking and easy consumption, to prepare brochettes. The meat or other ingredients are often marinated beforehand. The marinade can include a mixture of herbs, spices, oil, vinegar, citrus juices, soy sauce, and other flavorings, depending on the desired taste. The marinated ingredients are then threaded onto skewers and cooked over an open flame, grill, or barbecue. The skewers are turned occasionally to ensure even cooking and to develop a nice charred and smoky flavor. Brochettes are often served as a main dish, and they can be accompanied by a variety of side dishes such as rice, grilled vegetables, salads, or bread. In some countries, brochettes are also served as street food or as part of a larger meal with other grilled items. The popularity of brochettes extends to different cuisines and cultures worldwide. For example, in West Africa, brochettes known as suya are popular. They are typically made with skewered beef or chicken that is seasoned with a spicy peanut-based marinade and then grilled over an open flame, overall. Brochettes offer a delicious and versatile way to enjoy grilled meats and vegetables making them a favorite choice for outdoor gatherings, barbecues, and casual meals.